Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, learn and also interact. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, an agriculture teacher. In today's lesson, we are in Form 3, Lesson 7. And the topic is Livestock Production 3. The subtopic is Science of Paturation. On to the lesson objective. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to explain various signs of paturation in livestock. Terms used. The first one, we have calving. Then we have the second one as farrowing. And the third one as killing. The first one is calving. What is calving? Calving is the act of giving birth in cattle. And therefore, the cattle, uh, once they give birth, uh, it will give birth to a young one referred to as a calf. Then we have farrowing. That is the act of giving birth in pig. And therefore, a female pig, pregnant pig, uh, that is a sow, it will give birth to a piglet uh, during the process of farrowing. Then we have kidling. Uh, kidling, on the other hand, it is the act of giving birth in a uh, rabbit. And the young one of a uh, rabbit is what we refer to as a kindle. Then uh, we have uh, the various uh, signs of paturation. The first one, we have restlessness. And the, uh, the cow, which is uh, about to give birth, normally, uh, uh, is, normally move uh, up and down uh, with a lot of pain. And that's why we uh, normally say that they are uh, restless. Then we have a soaring a vulva. You can see in the image there. Uh, the vulva swells and become red. Then we have a uh, number three, enlarged udder. Uh, yeah, the udder becomes very big and also the milk veins uh, become prominent and the teeth, you can see, they are also big. Then we have the clear mucus discharge from the vulva. You can see in this black cow there, there is a milky uh, 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 mucus uh, discharge which is coming out uh, through the vulva. Then uh, paturation, we'll go to define the term paturation. Uh, the paturation is the act of giving birth. And what are the two categories of paturation? We have correct presentation. Uh, during paturation, we can have correct presentation. In correct presentation, this is whereby the, uh, the, the young one will come out through the vulva while the head rests in between the two four legs uh, or four limbs. Then we have uh, the images, as you can see, of correct presentation. And afterward, you can see that the cow has already paturated or calving uh, process has already taken place. You can see the the, the mother or the cow uh, just uh, uh, taking care of the young or the newborn. Then we have the bridge presentation. Uh, the bridge presentation, it is any other uh, form of presentation other than the leg and uh, the, the head lying in between the two four limbs. So you can see in these images here, uh, this is a type of uh, bridge presentation and therefore uh, the animal or the cow should be helped, should be aided so that it will not die in the course of giving birth because uh, bridge presentation normally it is associated with uh, so many death uh, if the animal is not helped. Then we have signs of paturation, we have of in a sow, in a sow. Then we have restlessness, we have reddening of vulva, swollen uh, vulva, swelling of uh, vulva. Then we have enlarging of the udder and discharge of a thick milky fluid from the teeth. That is, colostrum uh, is the one which is normally uh, very thick and it comes out through the teeth. Then we have building of, of nest. When the, 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 the pig or the sow is, uh, the sow is about to paturate, it, you, you, you will see it uh, correcting uh, grass on one corner of the pen so that it can prepare for the actual uh, giving birth. Then uh, we have signs of maturation in a dog that is a female rabbit. Then the first one is restlessness. It becomes at the state of uh, uh, movement. Uh, it moves uh, 
here and there. Then we have a uh, building of nests uh, yeah, as it prepares itself to, uh, to parturate, then goes off feeding. Whenever it is about to give birth, it will go off feeding or it will not have appetite if they're not going to feed, even if you give it, you provide it with feed. Then uh, we have come to the end of today's lesson and the questions you are supposed to tackle them, they are as follows. One, define the following terms as used in livestock production, that is product uh, paturation. Uh, B, uh, calving and number one, C, uh, farrowing. And the second question, highlight any five signs of paturation in a cow. Then for reference, you can refer from Secondary Agriculture Student Book 3 and the publisher is the Kenya Literature Bureau. For more information, if you'd like to inquire or clarify something from Elim TV, you can reach us through the following addresses using the SMS, using the number which is well displayed for you. You can reach us through YouTube. You can reach us through us Facebook and also you can reach us uh, through Twitter at rimtv underscore ke. Thank you for joining me in this lesson. Till next lesson, goodbye.